If you're trying to build a more custom product page for your Shopify to increase your conversion rates, this video might be relevant and valuable to you. In this video, I'll be going over Replo and using templates to create buy boxes and product page layouts, setting up dynamic data like pricing, titles, and descriptions, customizing your ads to cart buttons and interactions, as well as publishing your pages in Replo and linking them to your Shopify to replace your default product pages. So let's get right into it. The best and fastest way to build custom product pages in Replo is by first using their pre-built templates. So first start out with adding a page inside the product template section. It's different from the regular pages. And then starting out with any native section. So going to product detail and selecting the relevant bio box for you. And this is just to start. You can always customize everything as far as text, fonts, styling, colors, all that. But using that as a starting point and then building on top of that. You can also use full page templates, not just buy boxes or sections. You can use full page templates to help you from there. So after you've chosen a template or buy box that fits your brand, what you need, you can click on a particular element and set a dynamic. So in this case, it'll be your product title, description, or your pricing, even images. And this will link directly to your Shopify. So this make sure that your page updates automatically when something changes in your Shopify. So there's no need to hard code anything. It also helps with overall like inventory variance and syncing details across your store. So you don't have to change it each time you change it from your Shopify to your Repo page. Just gotta make sure that you connect the right product for what you are building for, and then it will reflect automatically like you see here. Now let's talk about one of the most important sections of your product page, your add to car button. In Repo, you can style your button as however you want, size, color, padding, hover states, everything. But more importantly, you can customize what happens when someone clicks on that button. So you can add direct to cart, open a side cart, order straight to checkout, change the different quantities, or even trigger a different interaction. The point is, you can do a lot of different things with these interactions that REPL has, and it makes a lot of the customization and functionality really wide open. So it gives you a lot of flexibility there. Once you've customized your product page to how you see fit, it's ready to make it live. So in Replo, you simply just click publish and assign the page type as a product page. But first you wanna just assign the correct product to that product template. So choose that specific product, hit publish, and you should be good to go. As long as you set the back end as far as connecting the page up inside Replo to the corresponding product, just by going to that drop down like you saw and then connecting that correct product over to your page. And then from there, just make sure you publish and that will automatically replace the default product page you already have with the new one you created inside Replo. And this is just an example of a product page that we built for one of our clients, Ramp Health. And this is just to show you the types of things you can customize and the flexibility you have when it comes to building custom product pages in Replo. You can have different quantity, like quantity bundles, different flavor variants, as well as of course the subscribe and save options. And the whole point of this is just to show you the types of things you can create with Replo and to replace your product page um, templates inside Shopify. So don't forget to set that up, set up different things like the quantities, different selectors, make sure the product, the template is connected and linked to your product. And then you can see here that we have a full product page that's live it replaces the current default theme product pages and then you can see here everything works and everything looks super great so this is how you set up and build product page templates in your replo to replace your default product pages in your shopify you learn how to set up dynamic data using templates and just the basics of Replo's product page templates. The next video, I'll be going over some more high level stuff, helping you guys increase conversion rates and building just better landing pages for your Shopify brand. If you want more resources or more information, check out the links below. I have a bunch of those free resources, free guides in there. And if you found this valuable, helpful in any way, please like, share, subscribe, and I'll see you in the next one. Peace.